In this video, we will discuss the number of subsets that exist for a given finite set. The number of subsets that a finite set has is directly related to the cardinality of that set. For example, consider the set containing the elements 1, 2, and 3. To list all of the subsets of this set, we need to consider every possible combination of elements that we can pull from this set. For this particular set, there are eight subsets in total, shown here. Now, consider the set containing the elements 1 and 2. For this set, there are four total subsets, seen here. Finally, we'll note that the empty set has one subset, which is itself. Have you noticed the pattern yet? Look closely at the cardinality of each of these sets and see if you can determine how the number of subsets was calculated. If you weren't able to guess the pattern, or want to confirm that your guess is correct, consider the following theorem. Let A be any finite set with the cardinality of A equal to n. Then, the number of subsets of A is given by 2 to the nth power. To visualize how this works, consider the following set A. The elements of this set are labeled a1, a2, a3, all the way up through an. So there are n elements in this set, which means that the cardinality of a is equal to n. For each element in our set, we ask ourselves the yes or no question, do we want this particular element in our subset or not? Since there are two possible outcomes for this question, and there are n elements in our set for which we need to ask the question, then there are exactly 2 to the n possible combinations, which result in the 2 to the n possible subsets of a.